Hello, everybody, and welcome back. We're looking at more of the 2005 Grade 7 Gauss paper, and we're on question number 11, the first question in Part B. So, question 11. The temperature range on a given day is the difference between the daily high and the daily low temperatures. On the graph shown, which day has the greatest temperature range? Okay. So, part of this question is, can we read and interpret this graph here? Okay. So, we have the, the filled-in dot. The bullet here is the daily high. So, there they are up top. And we have the daily lows. Now, I think just based on pure inspection, I'm pretty sure it's Monday. But what we can actually do, we don't have to just inspect it. Although, if you're confident in that, uh, although, uh, if you're confident in that, uh, go ahead and circle whichever one you want. But looking at it again, I, I think uh, Monday and Tuesday, there might be a little bit up for grabs there. So, so what we can actually do, instead of just saying, oh, gut feeling, I guess this looks bigger, this gap looks bigger, what we can actually do is we can you know, read off the highs and lows and compute from the graph and get actual numbers and back up, is Monday really the best? It's not going to take us too long. There's only five days here. Only five days to consider. So uh, what we, can we do? We can read it off. Monday is 6 and minus 4. So that is a difference. Pen's not wanting to work. That's okay. So Monday was 6 for the high, minus negative 4 for the low. That's a difference of 10, so that's 10 degrees for our temperature range. Okay. So uh, Tuesday, we can read off. Tuesday is between the 4 and the 2 for its high, so we'll say 3. And negative 6 for its low. Tuesday... 3 minus negative 6. Now this gets close, but it's just a 9. So we got Wednesday in here. Thursday. And Friday. Okay. So Wednesday's high is 4. So is Thursday's high. And Friday's high is 8. Let's fill those in now. 4. 4 and 8, and then we subtract off the lowest range. It's the difference between the high and the low. So Wednesday's low is negative 2. Thursday's is, well, it's between negative 4 and negative 6, so we'll say negative 5. And Friday's is 0. So negative 2, negative 5, and 0. And we can quickly calculate these differences. If you need to grab a calculator, sure, but you shouldn't need to. Part of this question, uh, doing it efficiently, I would say, is probably being able to subtract off negative numbers in your head. But we'll go with Monday, which is A. Okay. So that was question 11. Not too bad. Uh, join me in the next video for question number 12.